Okay, the phone line is in trouble. So I'm starting off with the, the panel already in trouble. So when they call us tonight, it's the phone line. Well, howdy ho, good neighbor. Today we're in an undisclosed location and you can see that the paint is on the walls and the carpet is in and the lights and ducts are in. So I gotta add five fire sprinklers, two uprights in each room and one upright right there. And you can see that the saddle is gonna be tight to that other plumbing. So I just don't know why we we're not in here earlier. Why is the white paint on the walls? Why is the white lights in? Those are lights actually now. And you can see those are already dirty before I even started working. So I need to get to work. But there's nothing like clean carpet and white walls and black fire sprinkler water. All right, you know the drill. Let's get to work. Okay, do you see how easy that is on paper? Isn't that an easy drop? Well, look up in there. First of all, the duck is right where I'm supposed to be. So, we'll crawl up here. And you can see how tight that is. But I had to move one upright from right there to right there, go figure. Kind of silly. Luckily there was a plug. But there's your head. So we'll straighten that out. Yeah, there you go. Anyway, always easy on paper. Always, look at this, the sweat off of my brow. People pay good money for a workout like this. Well, howdy ho, good neighbor. I just turned the water on, on this fire sprinkler system at this undisclosed location. And as you can see, this pipe was supposed to be prefabbed. I had to add a fire sprinkler in this corner there. You can see it. I had to drill a two and a half inch mechanical T. That means you drill into the pipe. And uh, you can see the coupon right there. Let's go up there and take a look. There's the coupon. Some inspectors like to see that, make sure you drilled it because maybe I just fastened it on there without drilling it, but you have a gap there. But anyway, that looks like it's dry to me. So there's your upright, six feet away. These sprinkler heads can't be closer than six feet or they'll cool each other down. So there you go. Five sprinklers installed. One, two, three, four, five. And that one, well, I'd hate to be a ceiling tile guy trying to put that in. I plug those up there, plug that one up there. Anyway, the water's on. Let's go turn it on all the way. How about that? You know the term. Let's wrap this bad boy up. So there's your mess. No drips, no runs, no errors. Except for the guy designing it. He makes errors all the time. All right, peace, love. And all that if you just...